enter Bollywood. Wanna catch all the excitement of Bollywood? Just log on to zootv.in. Okay, picture this. It's spring, love is in the air, the birds are chirping, the flowers are blooming, the bees are buzzing. You arrive for your first date with the person of your dreams, the future mother slash father of your children. And then everything goes downhill from there. Let's face it, the first date is a tricky concept. It's understood that it's the first time you actually get to spend some quality romantic time with someone. And it's also the time where you definitely have to make a good impression. Otherwise, there's going to be no second date. Absolutely. It's the time to find out about any common interests or, of course, lack thereof. There's also enough pressure about worrying about what your date thinks of you. Absolutely. So what the date thinks of you on the particular occasion. Yeah, or don't even bother thinking yeah. about it all. Yeah. Just take it real natural. But everything does make a difference. I mean, where you go, what you wear, what you say, what you eat, how you eat it. How you eat it? <laughs> yeah. Okay. But come on. What's been one first date for you that you completely were swept off your feet? What exactly happened? Well, there was one time where, you know, I didn't know the guy for a while. Mm -hmm. So the first date came a little later on. But, you know, he flew across the, the world for, for me, seven which is really nice. Absolutely. Yeah. Blew me off my feet. Oh. And, and then, you know, it's something very simple as a, as a, a home-cooked dinner on a lovely terrace with something like this. Really? Candles and... So I could go to another city and fly out here. Would you still melt? Melt? If I did the same for you? I think so. Yeah, she would. <laughs> How could I? I'm Look sure who I've got to. Absolutely. What about you? Would you do that for someone on a first date? I would, but I can't afford an air ticket. But I have tried one thing though. On the first date, I knew this girl and um, I walked up to her place and I had 12 bouquets with me. Mm -hmm. And I knew it was very extreme. I thought I either will be coming on too strong, will get slapped, thrown out of the house, or she could probably melt. And as Lady Luck would have it, the lady did melt. 12 bouquets is also safe because you can like hide your face behind yeah. it. So she doesn't what are you trying to say? Like, slap you right away. What are you trying to say? The face <laughs> wasn't good enough? Huh? <laughs> Don't fence Women dig this stuff. Women dig this. Check out the jawline. He's stunning. Yeah. Okay, right. on that very note, we're going to talk about vital signs. How well is your date doing? Take our quiz to find out. Question number one. One of you orders something to eat that's filled with garlic and onions. A no, B yes. Question number two. There are long silences interrupted only by one of you occasionally exhaling loudly. A no, B yes. Question number three. You bump into a few exes who give your date a dirty look. A no, B yes. Question number four. Does an ex-partner feature in the conversation? A no, B yes. And finally, question number five. When it comes to paying the bill, one of you insists that you pay for exactly what you've eaten. Nothing more, nothing less. A no, B yes. Well, you're getting the general idea. Here, watch this video in the meantime while you tally your A's and B's. And when that's done, we're going to get down to the actual business. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.